Hello everybody, this is me Reena and you're watching Rachel's Network. So today I am here with a new chapter of quantitative aptitude that is calendar. So what is calendar? So mostly what we do in competitive exam is that we leave the calendar question that is if you are asked uh, that is if a date is given to you like 24th of November 1957 and you are asked to find which day was that. We usually don't have time to think during the exam and give the answer. So we usually leave these type of questions. But today I'll be teaching you a few tricks how to find a day out of a date given. So without wasting time, let's move to the video. So before starting the questions, let's learn a simple code that is for a calendar we have months days and year in that correct so how to write the code for each let's see that first it's very simple just listen to me very carefully and by using these codes we will solve the questions so first let's see the day so we know that we have sunday till saturday correct so sunday monday tuesday wednesday thursday friday and saturday and it is very simple that you have to just number it from zero until the last number that is number six so sunday is zero monday one tuesday is two wednesday is three thursday is four friday is five and saturday is number six so you can pause the video and just click a screenshot of this next we have month so we know that months are from january till december correct so i have first written it as january february march april may june July, August, September, October, November and December. So how to remember this is we will just divide it into three, three parts. Okay, so January, February, March into one part, April, May, June, th next part, then July, August, September, next part and October, November, December, we will take at the last part. So how to remember this is listen to me very carefully. So first part, we will give the value as 033. 3, okay, so 033 3, and the last part is again 033. And instead of 3, we will give number 5. So 0, 3, 3 over here and over here it is 0, 3 and number 5. So I hope this is easy. Just 2 or 3 times if you will write, you will definitely remember this code. Next, for the middle 2 parts, this is 6, 1, 4 and this is simply 6, 2, 5. Okay, so 6, 6, 1, 4, 2, 5. So 0, 3, 3, 0, 3, 5 and 6, 1, 4 and 6, 2, 5. I hope this will be easy. So just one or two times you just write it down. It will be very easy for you to remember. So as I told that questions mostly come from 1600 till the till date. That is 2000. So let's check the codes only for those. So 1600 to 1699. That is the whole series. We will always denote it with number 6. Okay. So how to remember this as number 6. That is the last Saturday. We usually have 6. So 6. Okay. We are starting from 6. Then after 1699, we have the series of 1700. So 1700 to 1799, that is backward, we will go as an even number. Okay, so 6, backward of 6 is what? 4. In even number, we have 4. Next coming. Next is the 1800 series. So 1800 series until 1899, after 4, we have which? Uh, even number, we have number 2. So we will denote it as number 2. Whatever number is given in that series, we will take it as number 2. Next, we have 1900 to 1999. We will take it as number 0 because the next number is 0. So once we have reached 0, the last one again will go to number 6. So after 1999, we have 2000 and in 2000 series, the number is again number Six. So all the previous year question paper, you can check the questions are only in these frames. That is 1600 to 2000. That is the current year. Okay. I hope this code is very clear to everyone. Very simple. So Sunday till Saturday, just you have to give 0 until 6. And January, February, that is for the month. First three set, we will give 0, 3, 3. Last three set, we will give 0, 3, 5. Then for the middle one, 6, 1, 4 and 6, 2, 5. And last we know 6, 4, 2, 0 and finally so this is the very simple code. So whenever you get the questions, you have to just write down the code very quickly and using this code, we will solve the question. So let's 
see few questions on solving that is if a date is given to you how to find which day was that okay so if in case someone is asking you when were you born which day were you born usually we don't know okay what do we say we'll ask the parents and we'll let you know but now if you don't know your date of birth day then you can sit and calculate and you can find which day were you or born so friends this is the first question that is 21st January 1947 we have to find which day was that okay so I have written all the codes out here day, month and year I have just written the codes out here so that it is easier for us to uh, note down the numbers over here in the question so the steps that is we have to find the day on which 21st January 1947 was actually which day was that that we have to find okay so the very first step that we have to do is the last two digits of the year. We have to write the last two digits of the year. So what is the last two digit of the year? 47. So just write over here number 47. So this is the first step. Just write the last two digits of the year. After writing the last two digits, these last two digits just divide it by number 4. Okay. So I'll just divide it over here. So just to show you, I'll divide and show you. So 47 divided by 4 is 4. 1s are 4. We'll bring this 7 down over here. Again, 4 1s are 4. Okay. So in this case, you should not check what is the remainder. Remainder, whatever be the remainder, you have to just take the quotient. So what is the quotient? We have the quotient as number 11. So just divide and write the quotient that is number 11 so don't bring it to the decimal form or anything just take the quotient and write the quotient over here which is number 11 after that we have to take the date what is the date given here 21st so i'll just write 21 over here so after that take the code of the month okay so we have to take the code of the month what is the month january so for january what is the code it is the first month we know that is zero correct so zero We'll just write it out over here, number 0. Next, we have to write the code of the year. So, 1947, it is the 19 series, correct? So, 1900, the series, what is the value? 0. So, again, we will write over here 0, okay? So, first step, take the last two numbers, then divide it by 4. Whatever the quotient is, you have to just write the quotient over here. Then, the date we have to write. The month's code and the year's code. Okay. So after this, just add all the numbers together. So 7, 8 and 9. And this is 4, 5, 6, 7. So we get 79 over here after adding. Now what you have to do is this 79. Because this is asking for the day of the week. So how many days we have in a week? We have 7 days. Therefore, divide this 79 by number 7. So, 79 divided by number 7 is 7 ones are 7. This 9 will bring it over here. Then again, 7 ones are 7. And we have the remainder as number 2. Correct? So, in this case, we should not take the quotient. In the last, we have to just take the remainder. The remainder is number 2. So, after dividing by 7, we have to write the number which is number 2, correct? That is the remainder we have to take in this case. And after writing number 2, because we are finding the day, this 2 represents the day. So, 2 is which day? 2 is the code of which day? It is for Tuesday. Therefore, 21st of January 1947 was Tuesday. If you don't have the calendar of 1947, so just to show that this method is actually working out. So, if the question is the current, that is today, okay, 23rd of March 2021. So, we will check whether we are getting the correct day or not, okay. So, first, what you have to do is last two digits of the year, that is number 21. Then, divide this 21 by number 4. So, 21 divided by 4 is what? 4, 5s are 20, correct. Remainder, we shouldn't see. We should take only what? The quotient. So, the quotient is number 5. So, I'll write 5 over here. Next, take the date. So, what is the date? 23rd. So, 2, 3, 23 will write in place of date. Then, take the code of the month. So, March. March is, code is what? Number 3. So, we'll write 3 over here. And 2021, that is year's code we have to take. So, 2021 comes in 2000 series. That is number 6. So, we'll take number 6 over here. Next step is what? Just add all together. So, let's add and see. 
what is the answer that we are getting so on adding i'm getting the number to be 58 i hope you also got the number to be 58 and after getting this answer what we have to do we are finding the day of the week therefore seven days in a week so divide this 58 by number seven seven eights are we know it is 56 and we get the remainder as number two we have to take the remainder out here so the remainder is number two and you can check the day that is the corresponding codes day is what tuesday therefore 23rd of march 2021 is tuesday so today is tuesday right guys so I hope this trick is clear for everyone. So this is just a part of this calendar question. So we'll see more questions on calendar in the next part. So I hope this one was very useful and interesting. So keep on practicing. Find the all the days that you want to find. Whichever your, yours you have. Find the days and enjoy as well as learn. Oh.